Hi, Amy Jo here, and I'm coming to you from beautiful Duncan Gardens in downtown Spokane. Uh, some of you will recognize it from the cover of the book and also the title page in the Facebook group. Anyway, I'm here. Uh, I thought I have two things to say. And the first one is to, um, in the self-talk, in the self-talk group where we were talking about changing your self-talk and changing your life, um, we did 21 days of 14 days. I'm pretty proud of that. And, of course, on the 15th day, I thought of another one, and I had to kind of keep my mouth shut for a couple of days. So um, here I am. What I noticed was somebody said um, that they were late, that this happened and this happened, and I said, oh, my gosh, that always happens. And then I realized, oh, I just cursed myself. I just said that that will happen to me when I agreed with this other person. So I just want to give you something to think about that when you have somebody um, telling you something happened and you're trying to make them feel better about being late, trying to make them feel better about something, you know, we'll say things like, I hate it when that happens. That's not too good for our nervous system either. So we might want to think about that and not say things that make us agree with them to make them feel better. So I found, I caught myself when I said, oh my gosh, that always, ha don't worry about it, this always happens. I went, oh my God, everybody's going to be late from here on out if I agree with that. So I said, ah, scratch that. Actually, nobody's ever late with me. It used to be a problem, but nobody's late anymore. This is a rarity. I can handle it. I've, I've been here, done this before, but I don't have to do it anymore. So I kind of put it in the past tense. And so like up until now, that used to be a problem. So we're going to take our old statement of up until now and go back into making ourselves have an affirmative and say, you know, don't worry about it. These kind of things can happen. They don't usually happen to me though. I'm just so happy to be out of that. And you know, you can put the other person at ease without having to accept it and bring it into yourself as, because as soon as you do, tomorrow will be the same. Anyway, that's it for today's thought. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.